Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Diablo 3. We are on Torment 3 difficulty as I'm trying out my Crusader, which, uh, to be honest, was a really hard grind to get. Um, especially, I, I've become kind of, how would I say, jaded be the word? I don't even think that's correct, but, like, I guess I've become so complacent with how easy it is to level certain classes, mostly like range classes and stuff, that leveling a, uh, well, leveling like a melee character, even though I'm kind of playing the melee character as ranged, was really, really, really tough, especially since I'm also used to playing, uh, playing with friends, and so I didn't really exactly have... Uh, that's, I guess you could say, support in that, in that venture. Not that it's really any of their fault, it's, it's not. I mean, our, our schedules just didn't line up, so I pretty much had to do this, uh, this endeavor solo, and it was, it was a really tough one. It was tough to do. It was really, really difficult. I mean, not, not difficult as in, like, actually getting there, but just putting in, putting in the effort and the time, so I guess you could... You know, say that's laziness on my part, but it's complacency in one form or another. Just, just used to how things normally go, and they didn't go as smooth as I would have wanted or would have liked. So, you know, there's always that. What can you do? You can try, but doesn't necessarily mean things are always going to go your way. But I mean, it hasn't been all bad. I'm finally getting to play a class that isn't necessarily, for the most part, ranged. I mean, even though I do a whole lot of ranged stuff, like the horses and stuff, I pretty much get up in everything's face. So, I mean, ranged? Eh, not, not really. Not in the sense that actual characters are ranged characters. For me, not, not, not so much. Not, not so much. Do I have enough to horsey again? There we go. Come on. Not everything's, like, hitting there. Oh, man. But it seems like, for the most part, my Crusader can do this. I've only been playing on Torment 1, so I've never really ventured up and out of that area. Even when I'm doing Greater Rifts, I think the... What's the Greater Rift key that I'm on? I'm on an 11. So that's not even... I don't think that even qualifies as Torment. I think that's up to probably around Master, or even maybe Expert or something. So it's not... Uh, yeah, it's very, very, very different. Especially the way that um, I'm kind of playing this, sort of. And for the most part, I'm going to be doing the whole throw horsies all day, every day uh, type of deal, but I'm also kind of holding out for Condemn build, and there's also this new build that uh, uses the Roland set. So that was really that was really interesting. It's the Roland set, and it also uses Phalanx, but it's not the horses. It uses the the bowmen, the bowmen and attack speed to deal a lot of the damage. And then you're really just there to kind of generate more more wrath and keep things stunned. But I'm also going to need like a two-handed flail for that, and obviously more of the Roland set. So there is definitely that to go on. I also would like to get another. Ring of Royal Grandeur. Now, oddly enough, I don't know why I was not aware of this before, but apparently if the Ring of Royal Grandeur isn't the same level as your equipment, it does not give you the bonus. And I'm pretty sure I knew that beforehand, but for some reason I just, like, that just slipped my mind when I was playing Crusader, and I was like, hmm, why am I not getting the bonus from Akans and uh, not even Blackthorns, but Roland Stride and... You know, I was just getting, I was getting essentially nothing from it because my equipment is higher than the ring uh, is allowed to to grant me the bonus from. So that was kind of interesting and weird. But, oh well, I mean, you know, live and learn or live and relearn in, in this case. But I am, I'm really liking this Crusader. It's definitely, well, I mean, obviously the the class with the most toughness. I mean, look at this. Naturally, I have 8 point, almost 8.5 toughness. And DPS is, is okay. I mean, the fact that I'm able to kind of push this out is it's pretty good in itself, but I think a lot of that is due to also the 
the horses and my phalanx shield, the fact that it allows me to pretty much cast uh, horses twice for the cost of one. So, I mean, that's that's always a really, really, really good thing. But, all right, let's get some of that back. There we go. Uh, I do need more CDR, that's for sure. My cooldown reduction needs to be better. I think I only have like 30%. At 34.72. Eh, that's not terrible, but it could be better. Uh, the Akans will do great things for my uh, Akarat Champion. But I still need to get more CDR. I'm not really sure how I'm going to go about doing that, especially since my Paragon is in that category. I think is almost maxed out, or is fairly close. Fairly close-ish. I wouldn't say it's cl like close-close, but... Hello. In fact, let me see. What is that at? Cooldown. That's resource. Yeah, it's almost maxed out. It needs like six more levels, and I won't be getting any more Paragon bonus from. Or I won't be able to increase it any further than that. So that will suck when that ultimately happens. But, well, what can you do? I guess I'll just have to roll some pretty good equips. Pretty good stats on equips here. Hopefully. <laughs> this build is far from done, but it's already sort of outdoing some of my other ones. Which is kind of funny and kind of sad at the same time. Not really sure what to make of that, but uh oh. Oh my god. Where's this like lag coming from? Holy shit. <laughs> what the hell? I don't even know. Not really even sure what that was. Someone's probably like downloading something or whatever. It doesn't really. Like I said, I've never, I've never really had the best internet connection ever. But eh, I mean, as long as I stay in like the yellow, I should be good for this recording. I, I feel, I should be. Uh, yeah. Let's just get out of here already. We got about 50%, 45. Eh, that's about 50. Or CDR would be good. I'm not sure what the recommended amount of CDR is for a, a Crusader. I was going to say Paladin. I'm, I'm assuming it should be as high as possible, obviously, but I'm not really sure where a good place to kind of just settle on CDR before you get diminishing returns, because usually I'm not, I'm not even sure if CDR is something that would do that. I don't think so. It <laughs> probably seems like one of those things that just keeps helping out, but I mean, I guess in the sense of diminishing returns, I would eventually need to stop just so that I can invest in some better stats somewhere. But, eh, you know, that's for that's a bridge, uh, you know, that we'll cross when we eventually get there. It's a bridge to cross at that point in time, not right now, but I don't know. I'm really, I'm really liking this this change up here on Crusader. Kind of glad I stuck with it and decided not to really quit. It was the hardest thing. Like I've had my Crusader character for probably several months now, and it's just really, really, uh, it's really tough to kind of stick with something when it just seems extremely slow. All right, Got some of that back. Oh, you shielding! Really don't like shielding guys. Is there anything in here? There's nothing in here. Great. Cool. Awesome. Yes, T3 isn't going too bad. Had several uh, close-ish calls here and there, but it's not been like the worst thing ever. Thing oh my god. Shit has Waller, doesn't it? Sure does. It's like probably the most annoying and like affix for my character to face is just Waller because my damage, or at least I think my Phalanx damage counts as physical, and physical does not go through walls. I don't think a lot of stuff goes through walls, but physical definitely does not go through walls, which is kind of weird. I mean, I guess not really, but then again, I guess I'm just expecting too much out of certain things. Like range, I'm, I'm just used to being range, and it's just like, oh, I have a wall, I can throw up a spell, and just kind of hang back and not really worry about anything. Nope. Not this time. Not this time at all. 
Hey, these guys should be toast. Uh, let's see, how much do I have left? About 21%? 21%-ish, that should be pretty good. Okay, at least try to get this rendered out before I have to go to work. <laughs> oh man. Busy day today, busy day tomorrow. What the hell was that? <laughs> I don't even know. Oh, okay, I have to go back around. Oh, come on, let's go. Come on, horsey. <laughs> I love this horse, by the way. This horse, like, just lets me break all the rules, almost. It's almost as good as Vault in what it allows me to do, but it's better in so many ways because it just lets me just skip just skip skip what am I trying to say <laughs> I just like just skip around just kind of skip to my loo is that what I was getting at I don't even know I don't know it lets me do fun things and not have to worry about a whole lot of stuff but it also does suffer from the Waller curse so you know, I get walled in pretty good, and there's no escape for me. Not at all. Alright, I am liking this Provoke, though. I used to run, um... What did I run before? Not, like, Condemn. No, I'm just... Oh, what am I trying to think of? It was a skill that I, I, I threw on the floor, essentially, and it did damage. I can't believe I can't remember what it is, but... Oh, well. Sometimes that's just how things turn out, I guess. Oh, man. Okay. Ooh, who do we got? Who's on the menu today? Crusader King? Uh, I think most of my Akarat's champion is gone by now. Yeah. Yeah, it certainly was. I don't have to do anything drastic yet, although there we go. That's why that's why I love Provoke. Gets me some wrath back, which is really nice. Attack speed. I wish there was a better way for me to generate wrath. But until then, I guess this is okay. There we go, I can do this and get all that back. And probably take care of these guys because I'm getting wrecked pretty hard. Alright, let's pop Akarat's champion there, and hopefully this will carry me to somewhat closer to certain victory. Yeah, please run away. The cowardice in you is extremely strong. And done. Nice, got a keystone of trials, all this other good stuff. Now I guess I'm full up on whatever, so. Alright, that's great. That wasn't too bad. Uh, when we come back next time, I'll probably try a T4 Rift or something, and we'll see how that goes. But until then, thank you for watching, and I will see you then.